Hello, my name's Phil Kelly, head teacher at Higham Lane, and we're so excited today that we have our first ever Higham Lane Interfaith Day. It's a very special day for the school. We'll be asking the Mayor of Nuneaton in Bedworth to open the event, so we actually have representation um, from you know, a very important local figure. And we also have our Member of Parliament as well coming to the school to see this important day begin. What is the day all about? Really we, we are wanting to enhance our community cohesion uh, and bring representatives from different faith groups to talk to students about the different traditions that they represent. And we're looking forward to students really having an opportunity to discuss ideas, talk about modern life, talk about faith, what it means to have faith or to have no faith, um, and by the end of the day really to have a, had a chance to explore lots of ideas and present their thoughts on the world around them. So we're so excited, very proud that we're the first school in this area to host such an event. And um, there's a real buzz around the school. believe the amount of talent we've just seen. <laughs> it must it must look very odd me stooping. Well we've had a fantastic day. I've just left the uh, assembly hall having said goodbye to the students after an amazing um, final set of presentations but let me just tell you a little bit about what we've been up to today. I introduced the event to you earlier on but I walked into one of our halls today, I put an iPod on, I took my shoes off, I sat down and I thought about some of the issues affecting our world and in a particular exercise I took part in myself um, I looked at where footballs are mass produced in the third world, how um, tea comes to us and all the assumptions that we make um, I looked at how genes are manufactured and I had a very powerful personal experience of reflecting on those issues. And that's the sort of activity that our students have done today, really quite different styles of learning and uh, reflecting on other people in the world beyond themselves. Students have also spent time listening to guest speakers from different traditions, the Christian tradition, the Sikh tradition, the Muslim tradition, in special workshops. Um, they've taken part in quizzes, just looking at their current knowledge of religion and, and issues in the area and the number of religious groups reflected in the area for a book, raps, uh, you name it. Just talking about how important community cohesion is to them, talking about how they want to value everybody, um, whatever background they are from, whatever colour, whatever creed, whatever language they speak. And that is a very powerful message coming from this school at this time in our world and in our community. Um, so we've ended the day on an incredible high, um, a real buzz and I know those young people have gone away with a day I think they will remember for the rest of their lives. It's been a